guys? Welcome to another episode of Johnny's Fishing Adventures. In this episode, I'll show you how to fix a cast net real easy and simple way. Now, the first thing you're going to want to do is hang your cast net at a high level where all the weights can hang like this, all leveled and even out. The reason being is because you want all your weights to be equal to the rest. And if one weight is higher than the others, it'll not only mess up your cast, but it'll also mess up you actually catching a fish. What you're going to need is one pair of scissors and any type of super glue. Right now, I got crazy glue, but any type of super glue should work. You will also need some mono line. If you like mono, you could use mono. Or you will need braided line. Now, I prefer to use the braided more than the mono because I figured that it will give a better strength and it will be better. I always use it and it always worked out for me. And as you can see, I had some trouble. I used a cast net yesterday and it got snagged on a few rocks and it, it dislocated the weights from the net and I had to stitch it up. And there's all these other holes that this happened. So right here, I'm going to show you what you need to do. Now, first thing, you're going to find the hole. Right now, there's a little hole right there. You're going to find a hole or a gap that you want to close up. You do one knot on top of the on top of the gap, and then you lace the the braided line or the mono line through the other side, and make another knot. Now this is not gonna be perfect. Don't expect it to be uh, perfect when you first try it. What you want to do, the goal is for the fish not to escape the net when you throw a cast net. The goal is for the cast net to open up do its job and catch the fish. Now if a fish can get out through a big gap then you might want to close it. And then you get your super glue and every knot that you did going back and forth sewing up the net you wanted to super glue that knot onto the net. I find this to be uh, really better and actually gives it uh, a lot more strength than just tying a regular knot. And like I said, I like to use braided line because the knots turn out to be way easier than the mono line. So there you have it. How to close a gap in a cast net with super glue and mono or braided line. Real simple and easy fix. And it will be a good way to keep those fish inside your net instead of swimming outside. Alright guys, so if you like this video, please push that like button and hit that subscribe for more. Thank you.